Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Z. If you're new here, so welcome to my channel. This is going to be a general read for Pisces, you guys. Keep in mind, it's very general. It may not apply to everyone. It's totally fine if anything that I do mention in this read does not apply to you. If you do want more accuracy, you can definitely book a personal read with me. So basically, it's just a pre-recorded YouTube video that will be sent to your email. So all you have to do is just check my link tree link that's in the description box below. Click on book a read, submit your info. I will respond back to you, okay? And usually you will receive the read the same day or the next following morning, you guys. It's not like you have to wait like a few days or like a week or whatever. So let's see what shows up here for Pisces. What messages do you have for Pisces? I'm using some affirmation cards as well, y'all. Well, they're called affirmation cards, but like to me, they're oracle cards. I mean, I guess that's the same thing. I don't know, but they're new what messages do you have for pisces what messages do you have for pisces and also too i'm only accepting high vibrational comments as well just keep that in mind but look pisces we got ambitions that showed up here this is the first time i've seen this card too since i've been using this um oracle deck but it does say in a world where possibility where possibilities are endless i can do anything i set my mind to power and ambition courses through my veins when i in initially reach toward my goals my dreams will meet me with open arms some of you guys are super super ambitious here um for some of you guys i don't know why i say ambitions but it does say ambitious sorry <laughs> but yeah and I feel like this is definitely in regards to like, you know, work, career as well. It's like whatever it is that you could be doing, you guys. Um, it's like nothing is stopping you. It's like you're chasing your dreams. Let's see. What other messages do you have for a Pisces? Okay, so we got a release that showed up here. This card been showing up a lot, y'all. Because you know it's the end of about to be the end of the year you know letting go cutting people off before the new year <laughs> start but look we got release that showed up here it says release i release all jealousy that my body is holding on to instead i extend a feeling of joy and compassion for others that exceed around me this frees my mind <clears throat> and body to focus on the good entering my life so let's see here some of you guys could definitely need to release now, I'm not sure if it's a person or, I don't know, some something around you here could definitely be, like, um, in the way of you really going after your dreams, y'all, from what's showing up. So, let's get one more. Yeah, for some of y'all, you could definitely need to let go of some things. Just do, like, a little recap. I actually posted a video, I mean, yeah, like, a message about this um, on my channel. I forgot what I had titled it, but um, do, like, a little recap. Oh, it was called like check your circle. I believe it was. But do like a little recap of the whole year, y'all. Who in your life has really been like there for you? Have they been like supporting you? Um, and it don't mean really have to be like giving you money. If you got like an online business or like whatever you do for like work, career, or business, have, have they been like sharing your stuff? Like think about it that way. So yeah, some of you guys could definitely need to like release or like cut off some people here. Give me one more here for Pisces. Uh-oh. Hold on. Give me one more here for Pisces. The vessel. Okay. So the vessel, it says my, yeah, some of you guys are very, very talented, you guys, but it's almost like whatever your talent is, it's like, it could definitely be like a dream of yours. So it's like whatever is attached to you or like surrounding you that is not pouring into you. Cause you see there's like a face, it's like a, um, basically like a vessel or whatever. So it's like, if people are not pouring into you in regards to like relationships, partnerships, friendships, y'all let them go. But the vessel, it says, my talent, skills, hobbies, relationships, passions, and strengths are things that define me. My body is the vessel that contains these wonderful attributes. And to that, I am grateful. So, yeah, for some of you guys, it's like you are, um, you know, when they say, like, the body is like a vessel or whatever. So, for some of you guys, um, 
you could definitely be it's like you are very very powerful in whatever it what like whatever type of skill that you have or like your hobbies um but it's wanting you to know that you have everything that you need inside of you to go after your dreams but it's like you're needing to like check around you like your surroundings basically and release those things because i do feel like maybe they could be like kind of um it's almost like some unnecessary things that you could be need to let go of that could be like pouring into you if that makes sense so let's see and some of you guys you could have definitely had a dream about this as well y'all because that car slumber was at the bottom of the deck it was about you know, like sleeping or whatever but it was about dreams um but in a sense, this is like your, like a dream, like you chasing your dreams, basically like a dream chaser, dream chaser. I don't know why I can't say that. Anyway, but yeah, let's pull some cards here real quick. Clarify ambitious here for Pisces. Yeah, look, Queen of Swords out already, y'all. You already know who you need to cut off, Pisces. But look, you guys are definitely about to have some type of success here as well um surrounding like something that you're like super ambitious about it's definitely surrounding like your talent skills this could also be like a hobby that you could have too but um it's basically like you chasing your dream whatever your dream could be y'all um but yeah we got the queen of swords that showed up so yes it's cut off season for somebody clarify ambitious ambitious i don't know why i can't talk this morning but anyway Clarify ambitious here for Pisces. Tell me about ambitious. Eight of Swords. For some of you guys, you are definitely need to choose wisely here about some things that you could be. I feel like it's people, y'all. We got the Eight of Swords that showed up here. For some of you guys, you could definitely, and I feel like it's people. Are, yeah, I feel like it could be people around you here. But, um... For some of you guys, you could be definitely just needing to get out of your head here. Like, whatever your thoughts are surrounding your talent, skills, or hobbies, you guys. Um, and I do see where, for some of you guys, you're needing to make a choice. Like, Pisces, you could definitely be in a space. And I feel like it's, like, starting now. Like, whenever you're watching this read, y'all, because it's currently December the 21st today. As I'm doing this read, like, today and then, like, up into the new year, y'all. It's like you really need to make a choice, like... Do I really want to chase my dreams? Because it seems like something is surrounding you or like there's some type of distraction or something surrounding you. So it's like you're needing to make a choice about what it is that you could be wanting to do, y'all. And I do feel like it's like a sense of you um, distancing yourself um, as well. Just like letting people go. If you got to be alone, then go ahead and do it. But at the end of the day, look, you're going to be chasing your dreams. And we got the King of Pentacles that wanted to pop out. So I do see where someone's definitely thriving here surrounding business um, as well, like career work. But something has to go. I'm just leave it right here because it just wanted to pop out as I was shuffling. So we just gonna take it. Tell me about release. So let's see what shows up here for this one. Tell me about release for a Pisces. What's this? The lover. So for some of you guys, this could be a relationship or a partnership. But it looks like you guys are making choices here in regards to um, just people surrounding y'all. Because I don't know who you're dealing with. But right here it's saying the lover's card. So it could be like a romantic relationship or just any type of like whoever you're connected to. It looks like here you guys are going to be making a choice or you could be like, you know, make a decision about walking away. Because like whatever the situation is, y'all, they're not supporting you. That's what it feels like. Because you could have like, you know, you could have told them like your dreams or like, you know, things that you could be like ambitious about. and But it's like they're really not supporting you. If that makes sense. It's like, well, go ahead and walk away because like you're not really helping me anyway. So it's not like you losing something so give me one more here for release give me one more here for release a car was about to pop out but it went back in clarify release for Pisces 
five of wands wow y'all whatever you're doing for like work and stuff like somebody is definitely about to be like living their dream it's like whatever type of dream y'all have you're going to be living it but look we got the five of wands that showed up y'all so it's like a lot of drama it's like kind of people keeping you down like in this low vibrational energy here but it's like no go ahead and chase your dreams um pisces we got the star card that showed up here too so for some of y'all, it's like you are definitely showing up here as a star, whatever you do, like as a talent or like some type of skill that you have. But you see how she's, they're alone. They're alone. But they still shining, okay? And you don't want to be in this five of wands type of energy here. Tell me about the vessel. Tell me about the vessel. Wow. That was so many cards. What in the world? Tell me about the vessel here for Pisces. Thank you. Four of Cups. Tell me about the vessel. Thank you. Nine of Wands. Um, some of you guys could have gotten some type of, um, I don't know why I feel like an energy of like, like a social circle or something. It's almost like something's being handed to you, Pisces, but it's like you, um, need to be mindful of like basically taking care of your body. It looks like it could be alcohol, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie. Cause it's like something's being handed to you, Pisces. Um, and your need is to, um, just be mindful that like, if you want to check your dreams or, if you really want to um, be living your dream or whatever the case is, like in regards to like your talents and your skills or hobbies, like you got to make sure your body is right too, if that makes sense. It's like, um, we got the nine of wands that showed up here. The four of cups that showed up here too, but for some of you guys, you have like a lot of distractions um, that's showing up here. And your need is to like get up and get moving. It's like you got too much talent to be wasting, honestly, from what's showing up here in the read, y'all. You need to follow your heart here, like follow your dreams. Tell me more about the vessel. Yeah, look, Eight of Pentacles, y'all. Oh my God, y'all, the Eight of Pentacles. Somebody is gonna be like, you could definitely be like in the spotlight or about to be in the spotlight, y'all. But you need to make a choice, Pisces. Like, go ahead and keep putting the work in. Some of y'all just need to let people go, honestly. Like, people who are not helping you with your work. Or they're just not supporting you. they just there. The star card came out in the Eight of Pentacles, y'all. Whatever you're doing for work, it's like you're a star. And you definitely, like, you could definitely be, like, in a spotlight. And we got the Three of Pentacles, too. Yeah, for some of you guys, you could definitely be, um... Whatever you do, it could be, like, creative. Because we got the King of Wands that showed up here. Which is like a fire sign, but it's like a lot of creative energy. Um, you could be like a speaker or something as well, but it's like people couldn't know you. Or um, you have like a really good reputation here with the Three of Pentacles. And it's like you're doing whatever you love to do. So go ahead and do it. So let's see here. I'm going to pull some additional cards. I'm going to use my Daily Vibes Oracle deck for y'all to see what shows up. Give me one here for Pisces here. What messages you got for Pisces? What other messages you got for Pisces? Yeah, for some of you guys, you got some type of clarity here. You're about to get some type of um, insight, y'all, on how to level up. Level up showed up here, too. So look, y'all. But you know what this level up card, y'all? It's like everybody can't go with you. You guys are definitely about to level up in a major way. This is like someone's dream or something. Some of you guys got some type of insight here or clarity about who you need to cut off, honestly. Give me one more here for Pisces. Moving. Oh my God, y'all. Look, this is definitely some confirmation. Okay, I hope this is resonating with y'all. And if it is, go ahead and hit the like button. 
um, but move in silence. You guys could definitely need some move in silence here about something that's coming up here. You're about to level up. Now, it could be some type of work opportunity or something, some type of insight that's showing up here. But look, third eye on left eye, you already know. You guys already know who to cut off. And then we got bye bye that showed up here too. So it's like you guys are definitely um, moving on or like walking away from a certain situation. So yeah, that's what's showing up here, you guys. I hope that this was helpful and insightful for you guys. Of course, you can leave a comment below. Give the video a like, a thumbs up if you did take some type of insight or information from the read. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe as well.